Getting enough sleep and learning how to de-stress our daily stresses are crucial when it comes to our health and well-being. Note to self, note to self. Well, indeed, a stress-deprived, sleep-deprived body certainly can't repair itself after exercise, as Dr. Bob Marshall explains. Ladies. Hey, Dr. Bob. Nice so to good see to you. see yes. you. And nice to meet you. You're just joining now. That's great. It's nice to meet you. I heard wonderful things about you. We are a little stressed out these days. Feeling stressed? Well, why don't we sit down and talk about that? Okay, okay? cool. Well, ladies, uh, you're feeling a little stressed, a little grumpy, maybe a little tired. Yeah. Well, you're both at kind of a different phase. Maybe we can do a few things to promote more energy and make you feel stronger. So I think the, one, the number one thing we should do is take a look at B vitamins. And what we want is a living source, something that came from food at one time. And we want it to be in the fully methylated form so it's ready to use by the cell. And now small amounts have the kick of a mule. They really can promote energy by helping you to burn and use your food instead of storing it as fat. And so here is one of the best forms and just a very small amount in your food um, will make all the difference in the world. So it's in your food, not on your tongue? You can put or... it in your food, you can make it into a drink, any way that's convenient for you. Now we're gonna talk a little bit about sleep because this is so important to getting through an exercise regimen, getting ideal weight, and without sleep, you can't have good health. And really, one of the major uh, issues here is going into REM sleep. If we're not getting this REM sleep, we wake up, even though we slept through the night, and we still feel tired. Wow, it's pretty hard to exercise like that. So we have a combination of two herbs, Sisyphus and Magnolia, that have been shown to uh, promote a neurotransmitter reset in the brain. It sometimes takes seven to 10 days to really kick in. Now, this is melatonin. This is a liquid, so you would just take one or two or three drops under the tongue in this case, and you would do it shortly before sleep. This is probiotic generated melatonin, so it's very clean, very easy to use. I've been taking um, the supplements, and uh, I have to tell you, it really does make a huge difference. I don't have to take the, my medication anymore. Uh, for sleep, which was a big issue for me. I'm falling asleep quick. I'm staying asleep a solid eight hours. And for me, that's golden. Like, that's a huge win. One thing that even compounds the benefit of sleep has been extra magnesium. And I particularly like magnesium glycinate. The magnesium glycinate at 500 milligrams has been shown to uh, promote favorable expression of over 20 genes that regulate weight loss. It also tends to make it easier for the intestines, for your bowel movements, and uh, a deeper sleep yet. We got great information today, you know. We're gonna go finish our walk. Would you care to join us? Great, love Let's to. Let's go.